The advantage forging has over producing finished parts from plate or bar is typically that you're, you've got more efficient use of the raw material. You are going to get a component, a forge component, that is much nearer to net shape and there will be much less machining. But there are other metallurgical advantages as well. Now both bar and plate, by being in a rolling process, that rolling process is actually, because it's deformation in a solid state, it is a forging process and it does improve from the original cast structure. But when you take the material and then go through an additional forging process, you're further refining the, the microstructure. You are causing the, the uh, flow of the bar to then uh, follow the contour of the part. And you're producing a part that's going to have um, better fatigue properties and be a tougher, stronger part. Well, when making the finished part, if one is machining the part from bar, uh, you've got to realize that in that bar stock there will be longitudinal grain structure from rolling that bar uh, or even the plate through the rolling process. Now when you go and take that raw material and start to machine away uh, everything you don't need, all that excess material, you're actually going to be cutting through that grain flow. Uh, you'll be disrupting that grain flow. If you start with a forging, you take that bar, you reform that flow, you reform all that microstructure so it follows the contour of the part so that when you come back and machine, you're not machining through that structure in a way that would potentially weaken the part. And of course, if you're starting with a forged part that already has the contour, is already near to net shape, you're going to be conserving material that otherwise you would machine away. You would literally remove and put in the scrap pile uh, instead of having it be in your component parts. So that the forging process is shaping that material closer to your finished part and therefore preserving raw material. So for instance, if you're having to uh, cut contours out of a plate, uh, there's all the drop between all of those pieces as well as all of the material that you're going to machine away to create the, the finished component part. Uh, with bar stock, maybe you'll get a little more efficiency, but again, with a forging, you will get much nearer to net shape, you'll have much less scrap, uh, and you will be more effective and efficient in producing uh, the parts you want.